Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're well, thank you for joining me again. Well, as you can see from my laptop screen here, I'm just watching Maya Tusi catching up on the news about the uh, remanding in custody of Tommy Robinson. And I have a thing or two to say about that. Stand by. As you well know, there's the big rally that's going to take place in London tomorrow, the 26th of October. And I'm led to understand that the rallying point or the meeting point is Victoria train station at 11 o'clock. Now, let's analyse this. If you have a look at the last rally that took place, led and organised by Tommy uh, and all the fellas, there were literally thousands upon thousands upon thousands of people there. Uh, overhead pictures, it was unbelievable. Now, this is fresh breaking news. Tommy turned himself in. He knew that there was a possibility this was going to happen, and obviously the inevitable has, and more will come out over the, over the following hours. But what concerns me is the timing and what has actually taken place. What, what will happen now, and I'm sure he's prepared for this, he can't come tomorrow because obviously he's in custody. Now, there's going to be thousands of people pissed off right now. What do you do with that anger? Do you act on it? Do you calm down and think about it? Or do you do something else with it? The, the whole thing is the anger. As I've said many times when I've talked about video, things in videos to do with the followers of Tommy, the followers of Farage and whoever else, absolutely loads of them. And we live and breathe by what happens to these people and what these people say. So right now there's going to be a, a lot of anger that could boil over. Now picture the scene. You go up to London and you're angry and you feel like kicking off and then there's police in full riot tactical gear there waiting for you, inflaming tensions even further and then something does kick off. Multiple arrests and then you end up on the nine o'clock news being described as a far-right thug, the R word and every issue you can think of, and probably end up inside. Don't play their game. Don't do it. This is an inevitable setup. Go. Go to the rally. If you're planning on going to the rally, do one thing. Behave yourself. Do another thing. Show respect for those around you, yourself and everybody else. Go there, stand there, if that's your intention. And do not make any provocative action at all. Because I'm telling you the timing of this and what's happening next. This is exactly where they want you to be. It's almost as if they're kettling you all into a place. Uh, just don't... Don't fall for it. Go show solidarity. Go show support. Go do what you have to do, but don't play their game. Seriously. Otherwise, it will give them everything they want. Everything they want. Let me know what you think in the comments. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. If you're on social media, give me a share. Certainly, let me know what you think. And I look forward to talking to you again soon. Toodaloo.